I welcome you to the first ever Houseways All Industry Conference, bringing together all sides of our industry to share, care, and learn more. I'd love to come to London. I think it's some of the best retail exists here and so I'm always about thinking of children who just saw these the wonderful the premises particularly that you have here. So it's equally great for me to be here. Hello, I'm Guy Walstall, uh, sales controller from La Croze. Um, I thoroughly enjoyed the first morning of the Housewares conference. Uh, the highlights for me have probably been Ben Phillips's insightful comments on uh, retail branding and the state of the, of the housewares market. Interesting to, to listen to uh, Errol uh, from GF, GFK uh, providing all the market data. So there will be that, that repeat, the life cycle of these products is certainly shortened. To me, that's, that's the most important thing you have to figure out about your business. Who are you? How do you differentiate? What do you really believe in? The right side of the book is really where you apply this to your various channels. For us, it was complicated because we had four channels. I'm going to talk about each of those and show you. Um, and then, of course, at the end of it, you have to know your, your success. Hello, I'm Caroline Holford, and I'm the product category manager of Kitchen at Salter Housewives. Thank you. And, and have you enjoyed the conference? Yeah, I really, really have. Um, there's probably about five people at the office that I'll grab for next year and say so you really should have been there. To be honest, I go to sort of gold and a bit lacy. Um, why not? Opportunities, the diversity of the speakers, even the different categories that they're talking about has been absolutely fascinating. Really good. Got some, a lot of celebrity endorsements within our house. What do you think is the longevity of that from the consumer's perspective? <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Probably Linda Barker. I'll ask her. Yeah. <laughs> I'm Caroline Gordon, I'm chairman of the CHA Popware and Housewives Association. Uh, and with my husband, who's been compared today, uh, we run Kitchen Curves. Marvellous. And, and could you tell us what you thought of the morning so far? Well, so far I think it's all going really, really well. I'm very impressed. We've had very good speakers. We've had Cathy from Sur which has given me many, many bits of food for thought, things I can sort of put into my own business and years. And also with Rapid, of course, she's very articulate. And to do that with only a few notes, I am just... Well, I don't think I can do any more talking now because she's just was so fantastic. I wasn't sure what to do today because there's this fabulous article on um, the wedding list industry in uh, this month's Housewares magazine. So I had the choice. I could either create a presentation or stand up here and read you this article, which is really quite good. I'm uh, from Harm Trading and Options Cookware in Brighton, and I'm from Saffron Mall. And what made you want to come to the conference? Well, a conference like this is a fantastic networking opportunity and it's a fantastic information opportunity. So, um, you know, we're hearing some speakers speak today who have been really informative. It's a nightmare for you guys because there you are, the sort of, you know, the latest um, releasee from the jungle or wherever or, or um, uh, Celebrity Big Brother. You know, it's a real temptation to pounce on them and sign them up to um, model your latest skillet. I think it's all interesting. Uh, you know, you had Ben Phillips talking about retailing with a retail perspective. You had the lady from Rapid who had sort of two hats on. She was sort of retailing and sort of supplies as well. And you also had a gentleman from the Garden Trading Company side. Um, and I think Garden, garden Centres and Garden as a, as a trade is, a, is a useful from both from a retailer's perspective and a supplier's one. And the buildings, I think, are running at 24 at the moment, something like that. Um, their chief exec, uh, James Barnes, spoke to our group at uh, the back end of last year, and their vision is 100 stores uh, within 10 years. So those are the sorts of things that make me say, I think the figures that I've put forward are extremely conservative. Gives me a reason to go to a sales director and go, look at these notes, you know, let's take this seriously and go for it. There's a huge amount of enthusiasm in this Hi, good afternoon. I'm Peter Bellow from Lifestyle. Uh, our company includes Lifestyle, Pottery, and Royal Stafford. Excellent. And have you enjoyed the conference this morning? Well, as one of the sponsors to the conference, uh, we've 
very much enjoyed it. We found it very useful. It's been great to get the day out of the office to find out the trends that are happening in the industry. Hello, I'm Pam Plants and I'm the Housewares Director with VISA, the British Home Enhancement Trade Association. Have you enjoyed the conference so far? It's been absolutely brilliant. It's been a real showcase for the industry. And for those of you who haven't come, you've missed a treat. People when they get together, they are very enthusiastic. They care about what's going on. And if you think about building any supply attack, in what other industry would someone genuinely be excited about there's a, a new handle or something, or the new handle now came in in a different colour? It's been very useful, and uh, we certainly recommend it to others within the industry. Will you be planning to come again next year? Definitely. Yes, we'll be bringing more people. So yes, hopefully next year we'll be coming back and get yeah, just the same as new areas that have picked up from this year. I'm here so more than happy to come again, yeah. Absolutely, absolutely. As soon as the date's announced, it will be in my diary. Certainly if they do one next year, I'd love to come. I think the organisers have really done a great job and um, as Arnold Schwarzenegger said, I'll be back.